Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we'll be solving the integral of 1 plus x cos 2x dx. We'll be using the Lied rule. So let's begin. So there are two ways to solve this question and we will use the bypaths rule. We know that the bypaths rule is u into the integration of v dx minus integration of differentiation of u into integration of v dx. Lie 8 gives us the order of preference for the u term. Which term out of these two should we keep as u? Because it decides that on the basis of which term is easier to integrate and which term is easier to differentiate. So here we can see that algebraic comes before trigonometric. So the u term will be 1 plus x and the trigonometric term which is cos 2x will be kept as v. So let's uh, do the let's use the rule now. So we have 1 plus x into the integration of cos 2x dx minus integration of differentiation of 1 plus x into integration of cos 2x dx. All right, so 1 plus x. Now integration of cos x is sine x upon 1. 1 is the coefficient of x. So integration of cos 2x is sin 2x upon 1, sorry, upon 2, coefficient of x, minus integration of differentiation of this. So differentiation of 1 is 0 because it's a constant. Differentiation of x is 1. So ultimately the whole term comes out to be 1 into the same thing that we did here, sin 2x upon 2 dx. So this becomes 1 plus x, sin 2x upon 2 Minus, we can take 1 by 2 outside, it's a constant, integration of sine 2x dx. So integration of sine x is minus cos x upon 1, 1 being the coefficient of x. Let me write that down. So the integration of sine 2x is minus cos 2x upon 2. So we have 1 plus x into sine 2x upon 2 minus 1 by 2 into minus cos 2x upon 2. This is the same thing that we did in, in, did in the previous question also. Don't forget plus c. And the final answer becomes 1 plus x sin 2x, the whole thing upon 2, min, plus, sorry, minus minus becomes plus. So plus cos 2x upon 4 plus c. And that's the final answer. So that's it for today guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.